All right, uh, that's just an example of the impact Team Impact has made on so many lives. Duke Little, the executive director of Team Impact, with us now. And uh, basically, and you're going to meet Thomas Hastings, his dad, uh, Brad, in just a second. But, Duke, w tell us about Team Impact and the inspiration of what it does. Well, Team Impact is a uh, Boston based nonprofit organization that truly designed to help kids 5 to 15 years old who are uh, facing life threatening and uh, chronic disease. And we do that through the power of team. We've been matching these kids up with college sports teams throughout the Northeast and slowly across the country to give them some emotional and social support as they go through their challenging times. Thomas Hastings loves baseball. He's been matched up with the University of Hartford baseball team, correct? Yes, yes. yes. It, it, it's actually been a great match uh, under Coach Blood. Great environment uh, that he creates here. They're not only great athletes at University of Hartford, but they're all around great kids, and they've been awesome with Thomas. And today you're here because you're going to throw out the first pitch at Fenway Park. That's pretty cool, Thomas, isn't it? I know because this is my first time doing something like this. Yeah, are you ready to go? Yeah. Show us how you got ready. A minute ago, you showed me how you were loosening up here to throw the pitch. See, he's ready. And I'm telling you what, there's some guys in the bullpen who could follow this. Maybe they don't stretch out as well as Thomas. Well, hey, hey put him in if you need to. He'll be right there for you. We said if he throws a strike, they might leave him in there. Sure. We, I've read the story and heard about how much baseball has helped Thomas. What has it done for his spirits as he goes through uh, the battle he's had to go through? Sure. You know, it really gives him something to look forward to. Um, you know, when he comes out of surgery, he's had 11 surgeries since he was three. And he, the first thing on his DVD player is Game 4 of the 2004 ALCS. I mean, he's right there, and that, that, that's the thing that really calms him down. We, when we brought him here to Fenway his first time when he was three, we went for a walk out in the concourse, but every time we walked by an opening, he started crying. He just wanted to get back to the game. He watched the rest of the game. I like that. Who's your favorite player? Big Poppy. Yeah, I would think that's a pretty good guess, right? Because he's a pretty good player. Yeah. What, what has he done? When you watch that Game 4, what's your favorite part? And what's your favorite moment from David Ortiz? When he hit the grand slam. How good was that? Did you cheer? Yeah. Right, you know they've been struggling a little bit, so if they win today, it's because you're lucky. You understand that, right? You going to bring them some good luck today? Yes. All right. Duke, I want to ask you real quickly. You see these moments, and you, and you see these connections. Uh, it, it's a great idea. It's really exploded, hasn't it? It really has. We've, we've seen the benefits from one case to over 480 that we have in 36 states right now. And there's close to 1,000 college teams on our waiting list where we're trying to match kids so we're looking for the word of mouth from the families from those that are working with uh, the cancer institutes and the children's hospitals to help connect us with the kids so we can make more of these matches across the country Thomas you said you've never done anything like this but at the University of Hartford game you actually got to call in the reliever didn't you yeah that was pretty cool let's take a look at it this is Thomas actually calling for the pitching change for the University of Hartford That was pretty good. Like, you knew how to go out there. Show us, show us the move here. How do you call for the lefty? There it is. See, so you get the wave. You, now, did you, were you nice to the guy who was coming out of the game? Because he you know, was probably feeling sad that you took him out of the game. Did you pat him on the back or anything? Yeah. Because yeah, you don't want him to feel sad either. No. All right. So who's going to win today? The Red Sox. There it is. And that's the perfect thing, Duke. Thank you for coming on. It has been a great uh, event and a great – oh, that's terrific. Awesome. We're proud, and uh, awesome. we'll keep this thing going. Absolutely. Thank you. Again, uh, Thomas is going to be out today. Throw another first pitch right there. Fist pump, baby. Okay. Thomas, I'm telling you, if he throws a strike, he's going to stay in the game. going to start this game today. Red Sox need to win over the Orioles. Thomas is here to bring him some luck. We're back right after this.